Here's a little Asbury Park kind of song for you. Some New Jersey rock and roll. I enjoy to hear him play. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's that. Ooh, look, this is a saxophone. Saxophone. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I used to try to teach him how to spell his name. Mm -hmm. And he would always leave all that E. C-L-A-R-N. C. He didn't like if somebody was off. And be a factor that made it do this instead of this. He just lived for walking out on that stage and blowing that saxophone. And when he blew his horn, it could liberate people all over the world. The sound was enormous. You know, we, it was one of those things where sometimes you hit it off with someone, and even if you're not with them a whole lot of times, every time you are with them, it's so special, you just never get over it. One of the few people in my life who, from whom I felt unconditional love, he was someone who from the very beginning, when he would look at me, I knew he saw potential and something in me that I still can't fathom. Who do I think I am? You know, he had this desperation to, to understand who he was and how he fit in the universe and what the universe meant and what his purpose was there, you know? And that was constant. I mean, like everything he did was kind of like wove around that that I think that he was drawn to China because he, he was looking for peace and he was looking for answers. He was interested in going to a place where he was not famous, where he could be anonymous. I wanted to see what would happen, to see what could happen. Find your own true destiny and purpose in this life while the book is still open. I'm Clarence Clemens. Who do I think I am?